muzzle loader, shotgun, rifle, crossbow, archery. It's our choice. Well, welcome to the choice. It's a new show. It's not Archer's Choice. No, let's make that clear. This is not Archer's Choice, and Archer's Choice isn't changing. You know, bow hunting's been our love and our passion my entire life. And um, but in today's society, we need unity. <laughs> we need unity. We need to stop the fighting amongst ourselves and the division. And the best way to do that is real simple, and that is to use what we have today in the world of, of media, like we have on the Outdoor Channel, and we felt that we wanted to try to help make a difference. And that difference is simple. We created a new show. Now again, the Archer's Choice isn't changing, but we created a new show called The Choice. Like Ralph said, bow hunting is our passion. And we decided to do The Choice basically it was because in order to, to grow this great sport of hunting that we love so much, we realized that we need to push it more and not be so narrow-minded in the bow hunting part of it. And I mean, it's, it's real simple. And yes, you know, like we've said, we love bow hunting and that is our passion, but to protect the whole sport of hunting and to, to understand and realize that we don't look at, as, we don't look at hunting as a sport. We really don't. It's a lifestyle. It's for a us. lifestyle. It's a lifestyle for everybody. All of you out there, it's the same thing. We live to go hunting for the weekends, or we live to go hunting for that one week or the two weeks, or some of us that with, are blessed with, more. With whatever weapon that you choose, or whatever season that you decide to go hunting on, and whatever mode that's of hunting that you want to do. And that's the whole thing is that there is so much fighting amongst all the different Ourselves. groups of hunting within our hunting groups there's fighting and we have to stop it that's what the choice is about it's your choice you decide what you want to hunt with what you want to hunt for and how you want to how hunt you want to do it and as it, long as it's legal in your state province or country shut up we need to stop the fighting we need to stop this division because if we don't RJ, your children will not have the honor the privilege and the so-called lifestyle to do this. So that's what the choice is all about. I'm trying for the head. On our Yukon show, we head back up to McMillan and the guys take a stone sheep with muzzle loader and a father and son share a lifetime dream and both get their bull moose. If we go up and over here and then down into that valley, and across that spine, we can come from on top of them down. Yes. The wind seems to be blowing good across that lake, so we'll be in good shape. Yeah, baby! I'm Tom! Did you see What do you think of that? Woo! On our Texas show, Ralph and I go down to the Covenant Ranch with our Hoyt bows, and we each take a nice buck, and then we put our bows down, and we picked up a rifle and went predator hunting. I just got him. I just got a beautiful eight-point. Welcome back. Can you believe it? Whose buck is bigger? That's all I gotta say. It's a preview who's, show. It doesn't matter, but whose was matter. bigger? It does matter. We're stopping the fighting amongst ourselves, remember?
job, man. That was an awesome shot. Once again, we went down to Florida with Uncle Happy and Asshole Outfitters, and this is gonna be a two-part show because we took the entire arsenal of weapons down there with us for those hogs. We just have way too much fun down there with you, Hop. That was a good hit, buddy. Can you see a pretty plane there? What do you think is his shoulder? And you just take your time and squeeze it off. That big boar is down. Woo! That's a big blue boar. You got him, buddy! <laughs> oh, buddy. This week, we headed up to BC with Bat Nooney Guides and Outfitters, and we had a blast spotting and stalking black bears. And you know what? We finally put it all together at the last day, the last hour of the hunt.
Bat and Uni Lake guides and outfitters have done way beyond, have gone way beyond our expectations again. Welcome back to The Choice. It was my turn. Sorry. It's my choice to say it first, so knock it off. <laughs> like we said, The Choice is a whole new show, and it's your choice to decide what kind of weapon you want to hunt with and what kind of animals you want to go for. Well, last fall we went to Nebraska, early season, to Broken Arrow Outfitters. And try we, to hunt with our bows, and we yes. got into a bunch of deer, but nothing close enough. Nope. To, or the weather was 85 degrees outside. And Did you ever have a trip where you just wanted to reach out and touch something? Well, that was our trip, but oh. we didn't have our traditions with us, and it wasn't season. No. But posses Jake and, and Travis, and Travis went back out up. there. Yep. Late season. Muzzle odor season. Mm -hmm. And they had a tremendous hunt. Check this out. Nebraska, what a sleeper state. Mule deer, whitetail, all on the same tag. Can you dig it? It's a big doe. Man, it's a big doe. First mule deer ever. First one. back down to Florida, spotting and stalking it in the water, them silly swamp lizards, and I think we've all gone a little crazy. Yeah, the arrow was in him. It's hard to hook that big one. Right over in that hole there. Yep, right there. I'm just gonna bump it on the way down. Hope you bumped him. You, you got, got him. him. Get a hold of it, Pat. Give a good yank in it. Watch out, watch out. Right, get, your, get up, get Ralph. Ralph, get up. Oh, just hold Ralph, him right there. Hold him right Ralph, there. Welcome back to the choice. Incoming, Vic, look out, incoming. Help me, why we even decided to do a second show, I don't know. 
Whoa. Next, we're going to head up to Manitoba for, Incoming. for waterfowl. Freddie and Tony and Danny and the guys, they oh, all they had went a up. Blast. I think, well, blast, no pun intended, and I think their shoulders were a little sore by the time they got done with those couple days of hunting up there. I think, you know, that waterfowl, I'm, I'm, that, that's pretty addictive. This week is definitely the choice because we're hunting all over. It's the Hunter's Buffet, and you never know where we're gonna end up on this week's show. You know, it's so important that we once again, we drive home this message and the choice is simple. It's up to you. But the big thing we all need to do is we need to stop the fighting amongst ourselves. We need this division to stop. And that's why we we're trying to put together a show to show everybody that we're no experts. We're not claiming to be anybody, we're not. But what we are gonna do is we're gonna share with you exciting adventures, entertainment, fun, all different types, whatever the hunter decides to do, whatever That's choice right. he makes, which weapon he wants to hunt with, what animal he wants to hunt, which method of hunting they want to hunt with. We are no... That's the point. That's it. We are nobody to throw stones or to say, hey, you're doing this wrong or you're doing this right. None of us really have that power. But the power we do have is to say, you know what? Let's stick together. We're all in this together. We want to see this, the lifestyle of hunting Continue. Succeed and continue and, and grow. grow. So, ready? That's it. Let's get out of here. <laughs> 